Hi. Hello. We're AI again. We're ai again. In a new place. Probably our permanent place. Probably somewhere in this home. We may move around a couple times. When somebody inhabits this room, it'd be a little awkward. Except I don't know that you've noticed, but I noticed. You're in the wrong place. Yeah. I can only get. I know. You have to move. Yeah. AI squared. You left your Snapple, John. I don't know. Have you noticed? We have some Snapples here. There's lots you, of You, get changes. that Android away from me. <laughs> We're so anonymical. Oh, we forgot to start, but there's also a timer on the finger. Oh, well. Okay, we're drinking Snapple today. This was John's idea. We're repping Snapple. A, because it's hot, so we don't the want weather. hot coffee necessarily. Yeah, Snapple. Well, she's not drinking hot. Hot or not? First question, question of the day. <laughs> uh, second reason, um, John's pretty intrigued by the quotes in a snapple. They are uh, They're pretty cool. Weird facts under the caps. This says made from the best stuff on earth. Right. Can we clarify what stuff? Is? So we're hoping that we find some really cool. Yeah, we're hoping we really inspire ourselves and yep. you yep. today. Yep. With these snapple caps. <laughs> Give me a good time. All right, we ready? ready? Uh, <laughs> it's not as dramatic as we had hoped. We'll try to do better next time. I don't know if we'll do this again, but... Hot or not? <laughs> See? Mm, made with the good stuff, right? Real fact number 732. Real fact. The chicken is the closest living mm -hmm. relative of Tyrannosaurus rex. Wait, hold it, hold that for a sec. Real fact? Can't you just say fact? Isn't a fact real? I'm just reading. No, but like, you know. I'm not making this up. You know what I mean? What? It's a fact that a fact is a fact. So real fact, necessary, a little bit redundant. Yep. All right, good. Just got that out. out of the one. Say it again. So chicken closest living relative. Relative. To the Tyrannosaurus Rex, aka the T-Rex, aka. Which... I got turn on. I'm not really sure what's going snapple. on. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm guessing it's because they have hollow bones or something, and so they thought they like evolved into birds. And do T. Rexes have hollow bones? I don't know. Some of them. So that some, was, some dinosaurs do. That was I completely think. artificial. <laughs> All right, my real fact is number one hundred. I mean, <clears throat> I can't read. Mm. Number nine hundred nineteen. <laughs> That's a leap, right? Yeah, I can't read, okay? Okay. Um, I almost said the number sign as a hashtag. <gasps> hashtag 919. Okay. The lollipop was named after one of the most famous racehorses in the early 1900s. Lollipop was its name. Did you know that? I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I'm pretty fascinated by that. I wonder if it was a thoroughbred. Or an Arabian. Or, or another form of racing Desert horse. Eagle. Okay, my knowledge is not as artificial as your knowledge. So that didn't last very long. Race horses. Mm, good segue. <laughs> we can we didn't open these before. You heard the pop. All this is yep, yep. on the spot. Race horses. Um, um what's that one movie? Sea Biscuit? I was so bored during that movie. Especially during that movie. <sighs> Toby Maguire, man. It's just Wait, are you making fun of the way I said during? Yes, yes I was. Okay, good. Because I was gonna be like, wow, we really agreed on that, and I was hoping you loved it, but then it was okay because you made fun of the word I said. See, I mean, the first Spider-Man movie, I liked Tobey Maguire. Because oh, I was like, where are you going with this? Spider-Man and Seabus. I mean, yeah. Tobey Maguire, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's uh, like, but that was because I thought Spider-Man was the best thing ever. It was like the first real superhero movie I'd seen. It was the first one in like a decade, maybe. And it was good. Out. Yeah. I love that movie. He also, is actually a poop head. His outfit's way better in Spider-Man. He's kind of whiny. Super lame in Seabiscuit. He's got like He a just wears like baggy pants. Lower half of his face. He looks like kind of scrawny. 
Spider-Man, you know I mean? no. He tries to do that emo thing in Spider-Man 3. And it's yeah, we don't talk about Spider-Man 3. We just stick mm-hmm. with the first two. Mm-hmm. Because I really like the, the uncle and the aunt in the first one, except the uncle dies in that second Right. And also, Willem Dafoe is pretty much a great foe. Who's that? Uh, Green Goblin. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's scary. He's cackle. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, I'm not actually sure about his friends, like, what they think of him. Because every time he shows up, he'd just be like Willem Dafoe. Mm -hmm. But in the movies, I think he's cool. Um, I looked something up online. Why? To just, like, see if there was something cool happening. I was like, what is some fun news happening? Because a lot of news is boring and sad. For news. And upsetting. But this is not. This is www.telegraph.co.uk. And it's the emoji could replace pin codes in online banking. Oh boy. Interesting, right? No. Pins and passwords could soon be a thing of the past after a British firm developed the world's first emoji-only passcode. Yikes. Uh, so, research shows that emojis are easier to remember than traditional passcodes, as humans remember pictures better than words. Sure. Is this boring? Um, no, it, it, cool. it furthers my belief that we are becoming a pre-literate society. Once it's more. Probably do, but they're so cute. We speak to the Google to get our texts mm-hmm. down. We don't actually mm-hmm. type them. And when we do, we use horrible grammar. I did that for the first time. Our today. passwords are no longer passwords, they're just a bunch of smiley faces. Mine aren't. Well, right, but it could be. Oh, That's could what be. you're like, Potentially, yeah, 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 potentially. Um, but then it begs to the question like, there's different. Don't sorry. Speak to the Thanks question. to the, the question. The, oh, no. A little Miranda Sings moment. Okay. Um. Don't like different phones have different emojis? Or are they all like universal now? Uh, I think Google kind of has one set. So if you like are trying iPhone to. iPhone kind of has one set. But they translate pretty well. But like, what if your password like just didn't translate and you can. I guess well, I'm guessing. Phone. I'm guessing the code is the same. But I don't this know. Really nice. That's another I question. I thought it was going to be. That could be another question of the day, I guess. Does mm-hmm. anyone know? Does anyone know? Yeah, do you know? Why are the Why iPhone are emojis the iPhone different? Why are the emojis different? Okay. Uh, do we have any other cool real facts? Here, let's or pick false one. facts? Uh, why this $89 hoodie has a four month wait list? Do you want to know? No. Mm. Um, Eminem's daughter, Haley, is all grown up. Haley's comment. That right? wasn't that just a matter of time. <laughs> so this is shocking. This is shocking news right here. Again. She grew up! No! Haley! Are we peeking? Sorry, we, we peek? Uh, nine things recruiters are sick of hearing. I don't care. This is boring. Okay. I'm not into this. Okay, Google. Real interesting facts. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Google. Wait, let me talk to Siri. She's better. Hello, Siri. Wait, how do I make the thing work? Hello, Siri. <laughs> Find me something fun. Okay, I found this. <laughs> the Wikipedia page for fun. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Children having fun during a snowball fight. Uh, Did you mean Spongebob Squarepants Season 1? <laughs> okay, these are weird. Okay. So true facts. Number 1610. You could cover the Great Wall of China eight times with the number of jars of Nutella sold in one year. Ugh. Didn't that get like... That's re- really re- bizarre. Didn't that get recalled the first year because they were like claiming it was good for you and it actually wasn't? Or something? Well, I mean, they make it out of... Hazelnuts. John yeah, O'Shea. They, like, that was, they were claiming that. They were like okay. claiming that it's made out of hazelnuts, so it's healthy, but it actually is still not healthy. It's just. Let's think about Nutella. It's not just hazelnuts. Oh no. Oh no. It's glory. Also, have you ever put it on crescent rolls and then baked it? Soup's good. Ha! <laughs> Dave's not here to yell at me for the peaking. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The small pocket in the larger pocket of your jeans was originally designed for pocket watches. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me at all. It actually, because they still exist, I kind of want to go get a pocket watch. You would too, because that like fits hipster your hipster persona. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <sighs> all right, tweet tweet. Yeah, yeah. In yeah. the hood, tweet tweet. 
Because um, you could. I was all in. At Sammy Rhodes. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only... <gasps> gets brutally and fatally stabbed. If George R.R. R. Martin had written Star Wars. <laughs> I don't know who George R.R. R. Martin is, but I get it. Game and of Thrones. it's still funny. Everybody dies. Game of Thrones, mostly I just think of the women. <laughs> um, I have no filter. Stop me. Okay, at tearing up my heart. Shut up, Jonathan. At tearing up my heart. Like Taryn, her name, I like that handle. Oh, it's pretty funny. Tearing uh -huh. up my heart. Mm -hmm. Still no redhead emojis, huh? Hashtag mm -hmm. redcism. Yeah. It's good. I thought that was funny. Okay. At Steven at home. I can't wait for the next Mad Max movies. Bargaining Max, Depression Max, and finally Acceptance Max. Did I tell you I saw that? And how was it? Was it infuriating? No. <clears throat> oh. To say I didn't get it would be... Oh! <clears throat> okay. An understanding. Here's an interesting fact. Not a tweet. A blue whale's heart is the size of a Volkswagen Beetle. You just read that on your tweet? Yeah. Your tweet? I mean, it's Twitter, but it's a fact. At Daily Potato News. Me. Treat yourself! Bank account. Do not treat yourself. Mm hmm I read that one. I giggled. Sure. Mm -hmm. At the Funny Teens. Hey, are you a bank? Because you need to leave me alone. Like alone. <laughs> L-O-A-N. No. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. It's probably true. So, today we learned some interesting facts. Mm -hmm. Talked about some interesting movies again. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And here we are, yeah, wrapping up that about 11 minutes for solid. today. Thanks for continuing to watch us banter. We appreciate your time. faces, watching our faces. We'll get back to coffee sometime. Maybe we'll try something different. Hey, leave us a comment of something we should drink. There you go. That's drinkable by every age. Right. Commonly sold as a beverage. Commonly sold. Well, I was thinking Everything like, that's a beverage is sold as a beverage. No, I'm thinking things that wouldn't normally be a beverage. Them suggesting like us. Like mashed drinking. potatoes? Yeah. yeah. Or so you're away from that. Bug guts. Things you want your kids to drink? Right. Let's go with that. Yes. If you don't have kids, I don't know. Well, happy summer. Ta-ta. Happy trails to you. Bye. It's been AI Squared. Signing off. Yeah. <laughs>